join me at this brand new opera house built in just 11 months in the grounds of a stately home in Surrey. We'll take a look behind the scenes. Well, talking of unusual partnerships, few people could ever imagine building an opera house in just 11 months, let alone creating it in their back garden. But this is no ordinary story. The garden is actually the grounds of a Surrey stately home. It belongs to University Challenge's former quiz master, Bamba Gascoigne, and all because an opera company found themselves homeless. I'll let Sonia Jessup explain. <laughs> Tosca, a tale of lust, betrayal and tragedy. And behind the scenes, a real-life drama. The story of how Grange Park Opera found itself a home here in Surrey. West Horsley Place, recently inherited by a former TV quiz master. University Challenge Tournament, asking the questions, Bamba Gascoigne. Bamba Gascoigne was told the opera company had found itself suddenly homeless. They pitched him an extraordinary idea. It's not every day that somebody says, in effect, would you like an opera house in your garden? And then we watch this thing grow like a mushroom, at the speed of a mushroom. Day by day it was different. And suddenly it's now absolutely beautiful with wonderful acoustics. Incredibly, it took just 11 months to build. Five tiers, 700 seats, modelled on La Scala in Milan. It's cost £10 million. One guy said, this is an amazing stunt that you have pulled off, because everyone sort of was watching and thinking, mm, it might not quite get there, and we got there. I, it is amazing, and I have amazed myself. Now, there's still plenty of work to do, all those special finishing touches to add. Oak floors are going to go in. Designers Nikki Haslam and Paul Smith are going to be working their magic. And there are plans for an ornate painted ceiling. And with the gardens open for pre-performance picnics, it's hoped new audiences could be tempted to give opera a go. I've not been to a professional opera before, so this will be our first experience. I'm a musician anyway, so this is um, a really wonderful opportunity for me to, um, um, on my doorstep. With the professional singers, it was fantastic. The acoustics in the theatre are really good. It's uh, not often these days you get a chance to dress up, so it's actually <laughs> nice to do that. But what would West Horsley Place's former owner, Bamba Gascoigne's great aunt, the Duchess of Roxburgh, have made of it? Her ashes have just been buried beneath the orchestra pit. She was a great fan of ballet. She was a patron of the Royal Ballet, so she would adore the idea of a theatre, I think, in the orchard. Just imagine now, forever, she's going to be surrounded by music. She's got a lot of Wagner coming next. <laughs> <laughs> Sonia Jessup, BBC London News.